Did you know that Socrates' execution became one of history's most gruesome philosophical experiments? In 399 BC, I watched as the great philosopher prepared to drink hemlock in his Athens prison cell. His students gathered around, expecting a peaceful death befitting their wise teacher. But Socrates had other plans. He decided to document his own dying process for science. As the poison took hold, he calmly described each symptom, the numbness starting in his feet, creeping slowly upward. His legs went dead, then his waist, yet his mind remained sharp. He continued teaching even as his body shut down piece by piece. But then something went wrong. The hemlock was taking too long. Suddenly, violent convulsions seized his body. His eyes rolled back. Foam poured from his mouth. His final words were cut short by death spasms that shook the entire room. His horrified students wrote down every detail, turning his execution into both martyrdom and medical experiment. Philosophy had never been so brutal.